Hi kids, how are you today? I'm Brian, your teacher, and today we're studying a new book with Brain Bank. What is the title of our book? But look, look at the picture. Wow, that's a big animal. The title of this book is Mighty Mammals, right? M M, Mighty Mammals. What is mighty? Mighty is big and strong, right? Like this animal here. Mighty in Korean, you might say kodehan, kodehan, right? Big and strong. What is mammal? Mammal. Mammal is a type of animal, a type of animal that has fur or hair and it has warm blood. In Korean, you might say poyu dongmul, right? Poyu dongmul, mammal. Are you a mammal? Yes, we are mammals. Are we mighty? Well, maybe not, some people, but there are some really big mammals, mighty mammals. Let's talk about them in this book. Here is a mighty mammal. Is it a horse? No, it's not a horse. Do you know this animal? This animal is called a giraffe. Giraffe. It's really tall. Look how tall it is. Wow. This is a man here. He's that tall. He's that tall. Wow. <laughs> He's not even up to here. He's small. You and I are small next to a giraffe. How does this man Look at the giraffe. He's climbing a ladder. He's climbing a ladder. He has to climb up to see the giraffe in the eyes. So a giraffe is a mighty mammal. Very, very tall. We'll talk about giraffes later on. We'll see more about them. Okay, let's begin. We're going to talk about different animals. Let me give you some hint or clue. I'll describe the animal. Can you guess? Do you know the animal? Let's read together. This mighty mammal lives in the Arctic Ocean. The Arctic Ocean. Brrr, very cold, really cold. It's far north. Lots of snow and ice. Ooh, so cold. It, it, this mighty mammal, has a mustache. A mustache, right? What is a mustache? Gotsuyam, right? You say gotsuyam? That's a mustache. Do you have a mustache? No. I don't think so, <laughs> okay? I don't think so. Next, it has two long tusks. Tusks. Tusk is like teeth. Teeth, ipal, right? Or ipal, sorry, ipal, right? Teeth. Two very long teeth. Tusks, like this. Not Dracula, right? No, but really long teeth, really long. Dracula has small. This animal has really long teeth. Only two. Not all of them. Not all of them. Only two. Dugeman. It eats shellfish. Shellfish. So shellfish is like choge. Choge, right? Do you eat? Do you like choge? Do you like shellfish? This animal eats shellfish. What do you think it is? Moyo, what is it? Can you guess? 
Well, let's look at a picture of where it lives. It lives in this area where it's orange, orange color. It lives way up here, far in the north. It looks like this. This is its home. Oh, too cold. If we live there, we need a big coat. So what is it? Can you guess? Ta-da! It's a walrus, right? It's the walrus. Here are the two long teeth, the two tusks. Tusks. These are the two long tusks. A walrus can weigh up to, up to, right? It can get up to 4,000 pounds. 4,000 pounds? What does that mean? That's around each on kilogram, right? Around each on kilogram. That's a lot. Each on kilogram? That's about as much as your car weighs. Maybe a muso. You know, muso, a car, very big car. That's about the same uh, weight, really heavy. Wow. Do you weigh each on kilogram? <laughs> no, I don't think so. But the walrus can weigh up to each on kilogram or 4,000 pounds. Its tusks can grow up to three feet long. Three feet? What is three feet? That's one meter. Wow, that's really long. Joshim Hale, right? That's very, very long. The walrus has to brush its teeth maybe for one hour, right? Oh, no more himduro. Of course not. But if you had teeth that long, it would take you a long time to brush your teeth. Okay. Its body can grow up to 12 feet, 12 feet long. 12 feet, 4 meters. Wow, that's really long. So the body can grow up to 12 feet, 4 meters long. That is as big as, as big as a sports car, right? Do yours, does your family have a sports car, <laughs> really fast car? But even not a sports car, a regular car, or an SUV, like Muso car, right? That would be as big as a sports car. If you see the walrus, you say, oh, Muso wa, <laughs> right? Muso watta? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, maybe so long, hey, I'm sorry. But it's like a, a big car is coming, as big as a big car, like Muso. Okay, so it is a walrus. Next animal, Daum Dongmul. What is it? Let's look at some hints. This mighty mammal lives in Africa. In Africa. Africa. Here is Africa. Here is Korea over here. Here is Africa. It, it, this mighty mammal, it can swim. Ah, Suyong Chalheo. It can stay underwater for six minutes. Wow, six minutes? Can you? Stay underwater boo, 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 for six minutes? I don't think so. I can only stay underwater for about two minutes. Okay? Okay. It eats grassy plants. So it eats grassy plants. Blech. It likes it. It likes to sit in mud. <laughs> it likes to sit in mud. Ooh, it's cool, right? but dirty. What do you think it is? Moil. Morimnika. What is it? So it lives in Africa. It lives in this type of home. What is this? 
This is a lake, and you can see many plants growing on the surface of the lake, on top of the lake. So, what is the animal under the water? It is a hippo, a hippo. In a long word, we say hippopotamus. Oh, hippopotamus. That's a long word. Many people just say hippo. Whew, hippo. It is a hippo. A hippo can grow up to 15 feet long, longer than a walrus. 15 feet? That's about 5 meters. Oh, meter. Wow. It can grow up to 5 feet tall. So, 15 feet long, 5 meters long, and 5 feet tall. That's almost 2 meters. 5 feet tall, it would be about right here on me. I'm 6 feet tall, 2 meters, but 5 feet about this high. It can weigh up to 10 thousand pounds, about ochan kilometer. So it weighs more than two cars. That is more than two cars. Wow, that's a really big, mighty mammal. Wow. Okay, so we looked at the walrus and we looked at the hippo. Which one is bigger? The hippo is bigger. The hippo is mightier than the walrus. What other animals are there? Well, we'll talk about those in part two. But for right now, we're going to say, see you later. Okay, that's the end of part one. Okay, come back and let's learn more about mammals in part two. See you then. Goodbye.